All right, you guys, welcome back to WFAA Academy and Guidance Counselor Thursday. Today's main lesson is all about money and giving our kids success after high school. We're joined today by Rachel Villanueva in charge of post secondary partnerships and programs for Dallas ISD. This segment, uh, Rachel, we're going to focus on five top things that that students, families need to remember about financial aid. So I'll just let you take it away. Yes, so thank you. I think one of the major things to remember about this financial aid application, it is free to fill out. You should not pay to fill this form out. There are websites out there that will say, fill out here, pay this X amount of money. Don't. <laughs> Visit FAFSA.gov. Um, the application is online um, and it is user friendly. You can also fill it out on your phone. Um, so FAFSA.gov. Um, number two is um, class of 2021. You will use your parents 2019 income tax information. We understand the financial situations uh, may look different, especially in these crazy times. I recommend reaching out to your colleges um, to talk about the changes and document to see if it can get approved um, to get some um, uh, changes made to your financial aid. Even if you think you don't qualify, fill it out, okay? I can't stress that enough. Um, institutions require this to be on file for scholarship purposes and sometimes athletic scholarship purposes. So have it on file with your selected campuses. Know your deadlines. There are three types of deadlines. We have the college, so you'll want to check with them to see when they want it to be submitted. You also have a state deadline and you also have a federal deadline. Um, higher ed is big on deadlines, students, so um, pay attention to all college admission deadlines. Um, number five, most school districts offer um, a college expert or maybe it's your high school counselor who has that role at your campus. Um, I recommend reaching out to them and gathering information on how to start the college admission process. Um, in Dallas ISD, we actually have a college access program that services 36 of our high schools um, in collaboration with counseling services. So what this is, is they are able to sit down with students and help them complete anything college related, applications, financial aid, you name it. Um, you can find these experts on the Dallas ISD post-secondary partnerships and programs department. Okay, Rachel, thank you. Very good information there. And of course, uh, we certainly appreciate you joining us here this morning. You can find all of that information and all and all of our WFAA Academy lessons on our website and our app, WFAA.com. Just text the word Academy to 214-977-6028. You'll get a link that will take you straight to this story. Of course, we'll be right back.